Hi, welcome to What the Fitness today. We've done a series of videos for you on pelvic floor breathing, hypotonic pelvis. Today is hypertonic pelvis. So hyper, just like the word implies, means strung up, intense, um, tight pelvis, okay? So when you have a tight pelvis, you'll experience maybe uh, pain when you urinate, during sexual intercourse, um, sometimes clothing even um, causes pain. You'll just have a feeling of being tight and a lot of times that can radiate to your low back and so you'll have low back pain um, from that. So hyper, we need to relax the pelvis, okay? So here's my pelvic floor model. These muscles in here are super tight. We need to relax them. Okay, the bowl that is my pelvic floor right now, what it looks like is if I were to take this towel and tighten it up over this, so it's like a drum, it's really tight. That's what your pelvic floor looks like. So we need to focus on stretching it. So our breath focus now is on the inhale. So the inhale, we want the inhale to stretch those pelvic floor muscles. Instead of having them super tight, we want the inhale to feel like it's stretching the pelvic floor. And then the exhale, the contraction, the kegel, we want to make that very minimal. So the exhale should not be forceful and you really don't wanna feel yourself kegeling um, because that will exacerbate it. First, we want you to stretch it and then we can address that later. But for now, the inhale breath, think of that jellyfish going down on the inhale and then the exhale is soft. The inhale is stretching the pelvic floor. The exhale is soft, okay? So you really wanna think of that elevator going into the basement, the deep sub-level basement. <laughs> and then the exhale, maybe not quite going to the, the penthouse suite, but maybe only coming to the 10th floor, okay, of your 20-story building. All right, so hypertonic means I need to relax and stretch my pelvis, focus on my inhale breath, little tiny bit of an exhale. So yesterday I did uh, the goddess pose and we're gonna do that today, focusing on an inhale breath. So same thing, your feet are a little bit wider than shoulder width apart, hip width apart, my toes are turned out, and I am going to focus on the squat. Already in this position, I'm getting a stretch in my inner thighs and I'm stretching out my pelvic floor. So I'm here, inhale, my focus is on the down and drawing my knees out over my toes and stretching. And then exhale, soft. Very little pelvic floor contraction. Inhale, deepen my squat, drawing my knees out, feeling that stretch happen, inhale, Exhale softly, very little pelvic contraction. So again, I'm going to be quiet and let you hear my breath. Deep inhale. Soft exhale. And then on the inhale, again, feel your breath fill up. This whole canister, I call this your canister, everything below the chest is filling up. Visualize it filling up. That jellyfish expanding, that elevator going to the sub-basement, and then a soft exhale. And that's really gonna help you stretch out your hypertonic pelvis. Thanks for joining me today on What the Fitness.